Can you give me an overview of the TrimFoam module? Yes, the, the, the TrimFoam case study is, is a fascinating territory for us because everybody knows it in a sense. It's used in films and television programmes. If you want to do something like Life on Mars, there is a trim phone and it cues you into the, edia, edia, uh, the era immediately. Um, we've looked at it really from the point of view that lots of people know it as an image, but what they don't know is the backdrop to it. And the more we've delved into the uh, archives, the more we've actually found, which actually puts the trim phone in a, a very interesting historical position. Uh, part of the background is economic. For example, you've never had it so good, as Macmillan said in the late 50s. There was rising affluence. People could afford more. They could afford, for the first time, the concept of a, a luxury telephone. Uh, there were issues to do with what consumers wanted. Uh, once upon a time, you could have a phone, but it had to be black, a bit like the Ford. Uh, now you had a phone that uh, looked very different, had a radically different shape to it, and performed very different functions. For example, it was illuminated at night and so on. So all these things, in a way, uh, through the archive, actually interlink. And you realize that, in a sense, it's not just an interesting image and a design icon, but it actually speaks an awful lot about a whole series of interrelated histories. Technological, economic and political.